That's just how it is and after a while I hope this sits better. <laughs> okay. So feel this. Tune into the connection you have with Mother Earth with all that is and when there is balance, when there is alignment, that's when the energy flows to you, through you and it is a beautiful creation. I wait until the song and the prayer is said before I drink it but I can hold it into in, you can hold it in your hands your cup and your intention for tonight you can put it as a word into your cup when we have finished this song and the prayer now let's sing welcome Can be a feeling, can be a word, 
can be really whatever you want to use this circle for tonight. I invite you, great cacao spirit, I humbly ask you to be our ally and walk with us in harmony and in balance. Spirits of cacao, enter our hearts. Help us expand our capacity to love and to connect with others and each other. May we learn from your mysteries as we receive your medicine with gratitude and respect for many years to come. With this cup of cacao, I Oh. Let's sing another song before we do some before we do some visualization, I really want to call it visualization and imagination because I believe that's what truly is what manifest, manifests the things that we want in life if we focus with intention on, on this and helps us to whatever might be of challenges or things that are getting in our way or things that might distract us from our path and our focus it helps us to really get into the state where things flow again and then we can we can use this to really align and feel into ourselves what is it that is our next step that what is it that is your next step right so today i would love to sing with you sing with you <laughs> i'm in the singing uh, singing mode um let's see so let's sing the song from larissa gosler i am the song which i think is perfect for the full moon it incorporates the duality we live and experience in this uh, worldly life here and also celebrating and honoring our the beauty the melody the the rhythm and our expression and what we create um, as these powerful creatures uh, that we are here so enjoy
beautiful song. So now let's open the circle and invite the elements. I use the elements because it helps to connect to the universe, to all that is, whatever word you want to use to describe the magic and the mystery that exists and we are part of. So tonight we are gathered in unity through time and space. And we are here to honor our sisterhood and the connection that we have with all that is. I invite the element of fire. I welcome you from the east. Like the rising sun, you give life and you support our transformation. Welcome. May you share your wisdom with us tonight. And I welcome the element of water from the south. I welcome you into our circle tonight. I welcome you from the south, like the deep and wide oceans, and we can dwell in the same way as we can dwell in the depths of our souls. May we find healing and inspiration within, so we can bring our life into the world. Welcome. I welcome the element of earth from the west, like the steady and strong mountains, to teach us strength and patience. May you share your wisdom with us tonight. You support and nourish us. So welcome into our circle, Mother Earth. I invite the element of air from the north. Like the whispering of our ancestors, we can hear the northern wind. May you join us tonight in the circle and share your wisdom and your insights, your experience that might be of support for us. And I welcome spirit into the center of our circle. May you be present and may all energies and everyone joining this circle have the highest intention for themselves and the highest good for all. May you be present with us and may there be growth and expansion within us so we can learn and grow. And support each other on our journey. Welcome. Aloha, and so it is. So I want 
want you to connect with both the intention that you had set in the beginning of opening and the circle and also the if you have worked with the new moon before what you had maybe written down in your drawing journal what were your intentions so feel free to look that up and feel free to write anything down that you already feel is a topic or coming up You might also want to check what um, what zodiac sign is for you uh, today when you watch this uh, video. Uh, this can vary from from year to year because the calculations with the months and all that is not so exact. So. You might also start writing down those kind of things to learn more about the zodiac signs and how when the moon is in those zodiac signs, how that will also be a topic or impact us in, in, uh, during that time of the full moon.
so you can finish up writing and we will uh, go over to our visualization And my other beautiful friend had in Italy a very beautiful guided med meditation. Um, I love those two, but since there's always input um, and always information coming to us all the time, I really love to just sit and listen within and what comes up and usually when setting the intention and the focus for the circle it, it usually resolves around this topic anyway it's I can't remember I do this now for a lot of a long time now but I can't really remember that there was totally something else coming up. But of course that can happen and then that's fine too. So feel free to stretch and uh, walk if you want, if you need to, before we do our meditation and also Connect with your breath and breathe into your belly and, and fill yourself up and breathe out through your mouth. Today I use again my one of my favorite oils which is cardamom oil. Um, you can use your favorite essential oil to work with. I usually put this on before meditating because it also helps to uh, focus and each essential oil has different um, has a different fre frequency and therefore also different topics that it can support you with. Um, so once you get a little bit more into the rhythm I would say with uh, joining these circles you will also find your essential oil um, for this um, ceremony and work together with this topic and that what might be coming up it often is really a beautiful unfolding um, experience so feel free to find um, essential oils that you would like to to use and i will go ahead and start a meditation for us set an intention for the circle and see what comes up for you and we will have about 20 minutes of meditation and 
imagination.
with some insights and directions I, or even just the feeling of being connected and having stayed in focus for a little while no matter how much you of the time that you spend here so even if you have small steps celebrate I invite you to celebrate and feel free to write down what you have absorbed, downloaded, has come to you and I'll give you a few minutes to write some notes and fill out a little bit more afterwards.
might sip a little bit more on your tea or cacao. So now, let's just give thanks and fill our cup with gratitude for whatever has come up for you. And what I also like to do is to use my oracle cards and if you don't have one yet so I will take one for the whole circle for everyone joining and it has so far always worked out beautifully so I have no I'm 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 looking forward to what it will bring up today. got the card unseen the unseen earth ancestor sister is rich with the mystery there is no easy story to be won from this card. She offers you a path to walk, a path towards silence and the whispers of the earth. There are deep voices there and secrets. Stones speak quietly, yet if we listen, we can hear them and the stories that they tell are the words written upon your bones and the bones of your ancestors. Hear the old ones speak, all those who came before, ancestors of human flesh and blood, ancestors with fur and tooth, even ancestors of rock and crystal. The whole book of the earth is written within you. Go to the earth, find her silence, and she will reveal yours. In that quiet place, Listen to the old one within. The stones that fall in the silent pool of her leave no ripples. If you are humble and still, then you may see a face reflected there, old as time, deeply wrinkled, forged by an impossible love. The eyes that look back and you are as dark as the night and as luminous as the moon. Deep one within you, deep one within the earth, ancestors of us all. Under her gaze, all stories end, all dreams dissolve. Still as the root of the mountain, she carries, she cares, not for your chattering mind. Let her rise up and fill you, the old one taking her place at your side. Silent guide and comfortless safety, strength and effortless power. She has always been within you. Bow your head a little and give her the honored place that is already hers and she will thank you in a thousand quiet ways. Mm. That is a beautiful card. And 
exactly what I was thinking about when I talked about both the things that come into light with the moon, insights that you can receive, reflections that you can get or do around the topic that is important for you, but also when you exactly when you sit in silence you deeply connect and have the opportunity to listen deeply within you this is a card is really like has a lot of different facets so For me, it really speaks to the connection to the earth and when sitting in silence that we really know we are connected with the earth. We, we have a history, we have been part of this planet this life for a very long time and if we honor this and give this thanks and this gratitude it will come back a thousand times in also quiet ways so i hope i hope this I hope this card also gives you something to reflect on and adds another layer to the topic that you have worked with. So I want to thank you for joining here with us all tonight through time and space. Feel free to write down more and share something with with us um, afterwards so i will close the circle and we'll thank you the element of spirit for joining us here tonight i thank the element of air earth water and fire for supporting us on our journey for supporting us here tonight and may everyone who has joined in this circle here today may see and connect with the full moon and remember that everything that you need is within you and that your journey has led you here and I hope and invite you to make this part of your journey, of your spiritual growth and open up into the world of reconnecting to our cycles and to your own cycle. Because that is the most important one. So thank you so much for joining in this circle here tonight. I'll invite you to the new moon ceremony in October, where we will plant again new seeds and 
You can now let this topic that you have worked with even unfold a bit more until the days of, until the new moon comes and maybe this will add something for you to focus on and choose what to send out on our next new moon ceremony. So thank you so much. Enjoy your evening or day wherever you are and whenever you see and watch this. Thank you so much, beautiful moon sister. Take care, lots of love, and I'll see you in the next video. And after this inner work that you have done now, you might want to move and dance and really shake off any any um, anything that is left over and um, give thanks to the clarity that you might have gotten and the insights that you received so feel free to turn on your music and celebrate yourself you deserve it and um, move your body move your energy and enjoy a dance or two